we will try to understand uh, the need for uh, automatic function so usually you come across uh, uh, in system very log like uh, okay we have static and why do we need uh, automatic function how does it differentiate so let us consider uh, now here a function static now my function here here is a my function with some argument let us assume that uh, this function we are going to be called in the uh, mod source code so source code yeah source code we have a module that will be source code so within that we are going to call this function so it may happen that we may call it multiple times uh, so i am uh, if you call it one time it is fine but uh, we may we you if we will use to call multiple times so if i call it multiple times so same uh, stack memory which is allocated within the stack will be called so it uh, now uh, if it is being called at different time stamp that's okay but let us on the same time stamp if it is called it would become it would cause uh cumbersome uh, so indeterminate values can be generated so it, now let us uh, here i do have call uh, being done three times but in fact uh, most of all you may call 10 times 50 times a number of times so this will have the same location uh, whatever being allocated in the stack and it uh, it takes actions on the same uh memory so that may lead to the uh, difficulty so to overcome this guy so we need a static means uh, it should uh, uh, do not generate an indeterminate value so to do that uh, we are going to uh, have a automatic function No, I want to show you the definition. If you try to Google it, uh, you can find automatic function allocates unique stacked storage for each function call. So just to decode this sentence, uh, we are going to uh, check. Uh, I mean, let us see, try to understand. Uh, this is an automatic function. So we are declaring a function. So it may have argument <coughs> as previous. Uh, no, usually automatic has uh, uh, fun arguments and now in the source code you may uh, call it three times now what happens in the stack once you call it will have a uh, function a different stack for that a part of the stack being allocated for that function now if you call for the second uh, second time it will have a different uh, memory stack for a third time it will have different so this will avoid generating indeterminate output for the function so to overcome uh, this indeterminate values or if there can be a difficulty uh, to play with uh, single static memory static function or static method we come across a automatic function make sure that in the stack it is allocated different memory uh, that uh, confirms uh, that confirms the uh, each time the function call is made uh, it allocates a different uh, stack location 